know, you already save a lot of money every year thanks to our videos. So save on car parts too. Buy them on the Mr. Auto app. Shipping is free. For this operation, get hold of the air filter that you will find in the video description. Turn off the ignition. Pull up the handbrake. Pull on the bonnet release lever and open the bonnet. To access the air filter, you must first remove a certain number of elements. Remove the flange cover on the cabin filter, which is located at the bottom of the windscreen bay. To do this, unscrew the three screws a quarter turn anti-clockwise. Remove the cover, then remove the filter. Using a small flathead screwdriver, unclip the common rail on the breather duct. Now unscrew the flange from the cabin filter using a socket wrench and a T30 torque socket. Then remove it. You now have access to all the screws on the engine cover. Start by unscrewing the holding screw on the air inlet duct using a 5mm Allen key. Then pull on it to take it out. Now unscrew the four screws on the engine cover. Don't try to take them out, they stay in their housing even if they're not fixed in. Take off the engine cover. You can now access the air filter. Take out the filter. Before putting the new one, it is important to clean off the remaining impurities from inside the filter compartment. Please support us. Subscribe and like the video, that will be really cool. Take the new filter and compare it with the old one to ensure that they're identical. Put the new filter in place, pushing it down into its housing. Return the engine cover, screwing it back into position. Put the inlet duct back in place and screw it in. Screw the four flange screws back on the cabin filter. Then reclip the common rail on the breather duct. Put the cabin filter back in place and screw in the screws for the cover. Operation completed. Hello, if this video helped you, like and subscribe.